is Emil Kabesh, and I am a fisheries expert in legal and institutional matters for the General Fisheries Commission for the Mediterranean and the Black Sea of the Food and Agriculture Organization of the United Nations. I have always been eager to understand how countries come along to decide on the, their shared and rational management of their resources, in this case fisheries. So I came to the conclusion that the best way to deal with these matters is through intergovernmental coordination within the context of entities such as uh, the GFCM. Uh, this, to answer your question, this reminds me of the GFCM Fish Forum, where I saw scientists and experts from multiple countries, NGOs, international organizations gathered at one place to discuss the, the state of their fisheries and to identify uh, research priorities for the coming decades. In fact, it was at that moment when I actually committed myself to uh, marine conservation. I am coordinating the MED legislation project, also called the project towards a region-wide legal framework for the conservation and management of marine living resources and ecosystems. First, uh, you should know that the GFCM members are required to uh, transpose the, the GFCM recommendations into uh, their national legislation. And this is to create a harmonized uh, legal framework uh, for the management of these resources. Uh, so this project comes to support and enhance this practice uh, by addressing the, the, the general uh, lack of knowledge and access to this national legislation. It is certainly in the implementation of a regional methodology to collect, analyze and disseminate uh, uh, the, the information in the GFCM LEX. Uh, and this, is, this gives ground for uh, benchmarking, for a comparative analysis of the country's national legislation that includes also to identify and uh, learn new approaches uh, for the effective uh, revision of these legal frameworks uh, that eventually leads to their uh, harmonization. Uh, the implementation of this project uh, requires coordinated action and strategic communication within the target countries, particularly to inform about the process and the results uh, to the marine conservation community that includes also fishers. Um, this has been even more challenging during the context of the COVID-19 pandemic but this, this did not stop us from uh, getting the job done as so far we have been successful in implementing the activities of the project. The marine conservation community will be aware of the existing national legislation in the Mediterranean countries and will be implementing sustainable practices for the management and exploitation of the marine living resources and ecosystems. The project also brings a regional uh, framework for the management of these resources and a tool, uh, GFCM LEX, which is accessible in multiple languages and which is offering a direct contribution to its development and continuous update. Together for the MED is certainly an opportunity not to miss, since it makes it possible for experts from the Mediterranean region to engage in rethinking current uh, approaches to the management of marine biodiversity. It's also, it also encourages the local communities uh, to implement sustainable practices when harvesting these shared resources.